hope you are having a great day uh, yes I'm back and today we'll discuss a small feature of uh, Microsoft Dynamics NAP which was launched in uh, with the Navigent role data client uh, this feature is actually uh, I feel can be used by most of the users if they know how to do it and how we can set it up so the feature which we are going to discuss today is called as views so let's see what a view is a view is a filtered page which is commonly used uh, in day-to-day -day activities which a user performs so Microsoft have put some commonly used views already in the application but you can always create a view as per your requirement without even involving a developer or a partner to do that for you let's see in the application as you can see on my role center screen my landing page which is my role center screen the purchase order have some default views already placed like uh, pending confirmation partial delivery upcoming orders not invoiced and if I click on any of the view let's say on upcoming orders I get the same page of purchase orders but with some applied filters which are the document type is order status is release and expected receipt date is something and a flow filter which we discussed in the last uh, video session uh, of a date filter now that's great and that is what uh, uh, helps user when he is browsing through the application but what if uh, consider a scenario that I'm, I'm a user of a uh, I'm a purchase operator wh whose one of the responsibility is to uh, let's say uh, go to the vendor card uh, vendor list every day and uh, filter out some vendors uh, let's say for uh, location code uh, yellow and so this is a filter and then with let's say having a balance of which is greater than thousand so I get these two vendors today but who knows tomorrow there might be some you know we'll be processing uh, some uh, purchase orders and codes and payments and then this might list might get changed but this is something which I do every day and I need to come here every day and apply these filters every day what if if I tell you that this is possible to this view saved on your role center page on your landing page and whenever I log in next time I can see it over there without coming to the vendor page applying the filters and then see the list so let's see how we can do that let's we need to click on this where we clicked on the last time for the uh, advanced filters and we need to select the save view as okay so as soon as I click it it's pop up a window and say what the name you want to give it to so I say these are my vendors for yellow location just a name which I can understand it's not to everybody it's only for me uh, with my login I can see it and then I click OK as I click OK the application says that you have changed something and the application need to be restarted do you want to restart it now I said okay and you can see the vendor doesn't have a uh, drop down here or the expand menu here sorry as soon as I say uh, restart my application my application relaunched and I get a menu over here where it says vendor yellow and thousand so this is my view which I created and will here on my role center page so I don't need to go and apply the filter every time so I hope you like the video uh, please like comment and share the video see you next time thank you